Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 38, and this is war number three. And we're going up against an alliance called Gods of Mischief. So first, let's see who they've banned. Hercules, Ghost, Quake. Okay, Kingpin is globally banned, and my boy Spider-Man 2099 is at least whitelisted. All right, let's take a look at what we have in store. All right, don't have anybody on that first node. Ooh, and then we have uh, Cap Wilson. Shouldn't be a problem for Gallon. Whoa, nobody on that node? I wonder if they got caught. It's interesting. Nobody's on that node. I don't think I've seen that. Okay. And then we've got Ultron and Nimrod. All right. Let me see. Unsteady ground. Okay. And we've got... Huh. I'm still amazed that we don't have anybody on that node. All right, well, might be a relatively easy run for the left side here. Uh, I'll bring in Gallon. I'll bring in, let's see. Um, he can be nasty. So I guess I, I can bring in uh, Nick Fury. And um, Claire. Yeah. All right. That's what we'll do. All right. We will be back with the fighting. All right. Gallon is coming back to war. So he is definitely on my team now. Uh, until they change some things. Um, as long as I have this path, Gallon is coming to war. All right, so we didn't have anybody on that first node, but now we're going to deal with Captain America Sam Wilson. And if you watch one of my previous videos, you know that uh, I got wrecked by him on the mini node. He had built up a lot of Furies, and whew, even into my block, it did a lot of damage. So... We're going to basically <laughs> get intercepted. And I'm like, what just happened? Am I, is my timing just off? What, what's going on? But that's fine. For some reason, I was a little slow to start. All right. Boom. Medium, light, medium. We're building up our charges. And there's that. Ooh, look at that. So much damage. And I blocked it. But now, here's what damage looks like. Don't don't nerf him, Kabam. Don't 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 leave, leave him alone. Leave, leave, leave him alone. He good. He good the way he is, man. Leave, leave, go 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 look at somebody else. Whew. Ah, oh, that thing is nasty looking. All right. Anyway, on to the next section. Uh, I did not mess with that havoc. Uh, I don't remember who actually took that Havoc, uh, to be honest, and uh, who they used. Um, but I usually stop right there, and then I go off, do whatever, until it's cleared, or I wake up the next day. One of the two things happen. Alright, so this first fight in the next section is Ultron. So, of course, I'm not going to be using Nick Fury. And on this particular node, Nick Fury got whooped bad because of that bleed. That bleed is serious. Okay, don't don't play with the bleed. Uh, I thought, yeah, it's a little bleed. He should be able to handle it. He's got two lives. Watch the video. Them lives didn't help him at all against that bleed. But with Claire, even though... This is an awakened 
Ultron, uh, and I know probably uh, the folks that put Ultron here are thinking, okay, Claire, we see Claire tearing this note up all the time, but she does energy damage, so an awakened Ultron should be harder. Yeah, a little bit. He does uh, heal up some of it, but that's fine. She's still gonna take him down. It don't matter. Bring him on. All right, so we wanna parry him, get rid of that regen. And then another special two, and he's done. And I think at this point in time, uh, the boss is already down, so we don't have to deal with the global or anything like that. I try to time it that way, because why deal with the global if you don't have to? Now, if there's two defenders that don't benefit from the global, then it doesn't really matter. Um, but sometimes it just ends up being that way. All right, so now we got Nimrod. And you remember how I love fighting Nimrod with Nebula. Yeah. I think Galen is uh, becoming my favorite to fight him. I think he is. Uh, but we'll see. I'm still getting used to Galen. I'm still learning Galen. Um, the fact that he is immune to nullify. Now, on this particular node, you saw that shock? That's what I was worried about. Ne uh, Nebula is immune to shock, so she would have been perfect for him on this node. But look at the shock damage. And the shocks do stack. All right, so I'm like, oh, we got to finish this fight quick. But that's okay, because Galen knows how to do that. All right, so here we go. He tried to hit me with a heavy, but that's fine. All right, boom. All right. Right, right, right. Let's hit him with something. Hit him with something good. Boom. A special one. And the fight is done. Kabam, leave, leave him alone. He's, he's fine. He's fine the way he is. Leave him alone. I'm not going to take Gallon up to rank four until... I find out what Kabam is going to do. Rank three is fine. I'm not touching him until Kabam says what they're going to do. But anyway, that is my contribution to the war. Uh, as you can see right there, the boss was still up. Uh, but anyway, uh, we'll be back in a minute and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we won this war. We're doing pretty good so far at the beginning of this season. So you know I'm waiting for the other shoe to drop, right? Anyway, that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. Oh, let me, let me take a look real quick. Give a little recognition. We did pretty decent. All right, Jupiter ruled, RCG, sort of war. Congratulations for uh, achieving the MVP. We did well. All right, so take care, and you all have a blessed day.